much soap I had in my hair. Look at this. This is by Sally's Beauty Supply, or the box says Sally's. Nice spray on it, because this is sold at Sally's Beauty Supply. This is amazing. Can't tell me that those colors are not stunning. Wow. Guys, this is Better Natured Shampoo and Conditioners they sent me. They sent me Strengthening Leave-In Conditioners, which uh, we're also testing. Mm, this one's even stronger in the fragrance. It smells more floral. In that, where they sent me Heat Styling Lotion. And man, they must be watching my channel because look at this. I mean, 5RR. They see that that is my hair color. Look, 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 look at that. This is 5RR. This is the color that I color my hair. It's just faded out a tad bit. But look at that freaking color. RR, that means double, double pigmentation. Anything that has a double on it, double. This is 5RR. This is a 5N. What does that mean? A one letter. N means it's one pigmented. Two letters means it's double pigmented. And the fact that it can cover grays is more amazing. Okay, let's see what it does. It smells very fresh. It smells florally to me. Show you the texture. Just a regular, there's a lather. Mm. I have a little bit more in my hair already, but my phone dropped, so <laughs> I had to reshoot it. Great lather. I put way too much in my hair. Kind of interesting, a little goes a long way, but it's like super plush, but it's lathering this much. When I say it's plush, look at this. Look how much soap I have in my hair. Yeah, don't use as much as I did. I actually used probably three pumps like that on my hair. Wow. Wow. So you always use a double letter, a double pigment when you're trying to cover grays. Resistant grays, grays, period. Well, I'll be darned. It actually feels like silk. It feels like it has a coat of soft right on it. I'll be darned. This feels great, conditioner. Mmm, this one's even stronger in the fragrance. It smells more floral, florally. See what this does. Fragrance is lovely. I always put it back here where it gets knotted all the time. And then work it in. Leaves your hair uh, so soft where you can slide your fingers through. It leaves your hair so soft where you can slide your fingers through. You get no knots. But then when you rinse it off, when you dry it, you can feel like the plush goes down a little bit and it leaves it lightweight, but it's still soft at the same time, if that makes sense. So if you guys ever wonder why I have such healthy hair, even though I process it so much, because I always put a product on right after I shampoo and condition. Okay, okay. We got the bottles for hair coloring. Yes, we do. We got the hydrating leave. That's called hydrating leave-in milk. Hydrating leave-in milk by Better Natured. I'm going to spray it in because it says to spray it in. You can see I haven't even used it ever. I'm going to spray it in the hair. Nice spray. Um, and then I'm going to wake up and style it tomorrow. It smells nice. I have been cooking all morning, so I kind of threw it up and I forgot to turn it on. Let me show you guys. So look, it should be all frizzy and it's not frizzy. You can see the curls. My hair is individual, so I'm going to straighten it. We're going to see what it looks like. Wow, look at this, how much volume I actually have. It feels like it's coated just very, very super lightly and protected. But look at this. I have, my hair looks great. Got to do something with my bangs, but hair looks great. I would assume it's like a leave-in conditioner. And this is the volume. This is the developer, right? We got 20 volume, which lifts your color two levels. And we got 20 volume, which lifts your color two levels. If you are a resistant gray, you have to use 20 volume because what it will do, it will open that cuticle and then boom, it will throw that color right into that hair shaft.
do the leave-in cream. So let's see what this smells like, what it feels like, and what my hair looks like in the morning. That's the most important. You can see that's what it looks like. Mm, it still has that beautiful, like floral fragrance. So I'm gonna put quite a bit like you saw because that's what I normally do. And that is how I keep my hair healthy. It is a, if you do this, if you shower at night and you um, do this step, you'll see a big difference in your hair health. Paddle brush, paddle brush. Not something where the bristles are so hard uh, because obviously we don't wanna be pulling too hard on the hair or ripping it out. And a paddle brush, the bristles move and kind of go with your hair. So see, that's it. Look at that. Okay, we're going to bed. I'll let you go. I'll let you see what it looks like in the morning. So I've already been up for about two hours cooking, moving around. And let me tell you, I know I've touched my hair so it got frizzy, but when I woke up, it looked more like this where you didn't see any frizz at all. I will say if you have curly hair, I think what I should have done is gotten a wide tooth comb and then separated it and gone to bed and these would have been so much more defined and not puffy. So the leave-in conditioner, yeah, I like it. It does leave your hair feeling like you might have a little bit of a very, very lightweight, very, very lightweight, soft mousse in it. Um, but look at this. I mean, like my curls are not like, I mean, my curls normally, or like, let me try to show you in the morning. Look at that, I can't even get them to be as frizzy as they normally are. Yeah, I, I, I like it. I wore my hair like this yesterday. I wore it, I didn't even style it. I kind of just put a little clip in it and I wore it with all that product. And as you saw it, look at my hair now, guys. Like you would assume that it would be super duper frizzy considering it's been up in a ponytail. I've pulled it back several times and I'm still not frizzy. This is literally what you saw yesterday and it still has that coat in there. You can feel it. So I'm gonna straighten it. I wanna see, uh, this is the second day of it having, or being like this and having the leave-in conditioner in it. So I wonder what it's gonna look like if I straighten it. So that's what I'm gonna do for you guys. So let's do it right now. You see that's a pretty big chunk. So let's see. If this flat iron steams off the product, if it keeps the product in the hair. So you see a little steam, which is good because I want to see the product steaming off. I don't know if you can see the steam. Can you see this? Look at this. Let me see. When you go slow, you're supposed to go slow. Get the brush, put it behind it to make sure it's nice and flat and then continue down. Can you see the little, let's see here. I'm trying to get in a place where you can see it. Can you see that on camera, the steam? That is the product steaming off or that is the product adhering to your hair. Wow, it actually feels, it feels great. It feels very clean, believe it or not. You would think like I would feel like, oh, you know, I felt that product in my hair prior to this and flat ironing it. I'm just going to feel it even more so. No, actually, I don't. Let me show you. Look. Look how clean and healthy it looks. Feels, honestly. Comb all the knots out, put the straightener on it, and then go slow. Put the brush in the back of that part. And then just go slow, travel down. You do not have to go over your hair a billion times like a lot of people will. You'll see them on social media running over the same strand over and over. Because when you do that, you're damaging the actual hair. So this piece, I can feel that I have a lot of product in this one area, in this large, large section I grabbed. So let's see what it feels like afterwards. Let's see. Slide it down. Product is steaming. Let's see. Let's see together. Oops. Look at that. 
No, it feels great. I mean, obviously I have a little product in there, but it doesn't really, you can feel it, but you can't feel it. It almost is like my hair just kind of feels soft. Wow, I'm pretty impressed. I am pretty darn impressed. The Sally's Better Natured line of up to 99% naturally dried naturally derived vegan hair color and care products is now available to shop at bally's bally's at sally's beauty in store and online this sucker says yes triple plant milk blend animal test free and vegan and it says recycle with TerraCycle. it says no that it has no soaplates no paraffins no phospholates no gluten and no silicone. Look at this. Look at my hair, guys. I finished, I finished flat ironing it and look at it. So honestly, you guys know I have a very, very thick hair, right? So that conditioner, the leave-in conditioner. So I take it back. It says it's a leave-in cream, strengthening leave-in cream. It's 94% naturally derived, 6% pure science. It says it's supposed to help strengthen and shield the hair from damage. And it says I was supposed to apply a small amount. You guys saw how much I applied and the fact that it is like, look at it. It is great. Man, this is, this would be great for curls. I mean, you saw that I woke up with no like frizz and I straightened it and it, I can still feel like it has the product in there, but it's so like not there is at the same time. And look at like my hair's great. If you have thick hair, you're going to freaking love, love this. Gosh, this is freaking awesome. And it smells good. It smells good, really, truly. Riety. This, I am so excited. I can see why they sent me the 5R because this is 5RR. That's super, super red, right? Oh, I love that color. But I am a little bit more brown, so they sent me the 5N, which is a, a neutral brown, just to tone it down a little bit. But that's a beautiful.